How to lose belly fat Everyone has some belly fat, even people who have flat abs. That is normal, but too much belly fat can affect your health in a way that other fat does not. Some of your fat is under your skin. The other fat is deeper inside, around your heart, lungs, liver, and other organs. It's that deeper fat called visceral fat which may be the biggest problem, even for thin people. To get healthier and lose dangerous belly fat, you will need to change your diet, exercise routine, and lifestyle for a longer period of time. However, for a week you can start making some big, health promoting changes to your lifestyle, all you need is determination. Method 1. Add useful foods to reduce belly fat. Enjoy the right types of fat, studies have shown that eating the right kinds of fat, such as monounsaturated fats can help reduce belly fat or visceral by up to 20% on low-fat diets. Monounsaturated fats are a type of fatty acid that has been linked to lowering the risk of heart disease, improving diabetes management and improving the function of your blood vessels. Eat Lean Protein Lean sources of protein will help you stay satisfied throughout the day and help fuel your weight loss. Make sure you eat source of lean protein at every meal. Measure a serving of 3 to 4 ounces, 21-28 grams, to stay within your calorie limit, add fresh fruits and vegetables at every meal. Make sure that at least half of your plate is full of fruits and vegetables. These low-calorie foods are rich in nutrients and can help you lose weight and reduce belly fat. The best way to lose belly fat is reducing calories. When you make half your plate a fruit or vegetable, the low-calorie nature of these foods helps reduce the overall calorie content of your meals. Choose whole grain foods. When you are trying to reduce belly fat and get rid of dangerous visceral fat, you will need to choose 100% whole grain foods when you are eating a bread, rice or pasta. 100% whole grains are significantly higher in fiber, protein, vitamins and minerals compared to the more refined grains. They are a much more nutritious option. Drink adequate amounts of water. Help your body feel more satisfied and hydrated by drinking adequate amounts of water and other clear liquids every day. It is generally recommended to drink at least 8 glasses of water a day. However, even amounts of up to 13 glasses per day have been recommended. Method 2. Eliminate problematic foods to reduce belly fat. Cut the sugar in refined white flour. Studies have shown that one of the biggest culprits of visceral fat is sugary drinks, sweets, and foods made from refined white flour. Limit or cut these foods to help reduce belly fat. Sugary drinks like sodas, fruit juices, and sports drinks, as well as sweets, desserts or cakes can increase visceral fat. In addition, foods made from white flour or highly processed carbohydrates are also responsible for packing on fat. Cut out alcoholic drinks. Many studies have shown that increased alcohol consumption is linked to increased amounts of visceral fat. Limit or cut alcoholic beverages to help reduce belly fat. Limit high fat foods. In addition to choosing sources of healthy fats to include in your diet, you should also try to limit or avoid certain types of fat that can increase belly fat and the chronic conditions associated with it. Method 3. Increase exercise and activity. Do interval exercises 2 to 3 days this week. Higher intensity interval workouts have become more popular. It is known that calories from the torch, but specifically burn larger amounts of body fat compared to traditional cardio. Commit at least 30 minutes of cardio 5 days a week. In addition to interval training, studies have shown that it is equally important to do at least 30 minutes of cardio each week, to help reduce belly fat. Increase your daily activity levels. Lifestyle activities are a great way to add more exercise to your day. Being more active throughout the day has been shown to have similar benefits to 150 minutes of planned cardio each week. Do strength training exercises 1 to 3 times this week, 
Weightlifting builds lean muscle mass which can help boost your body's metabolism and the ability to burn calories at rest.